Hey guys, today we're gonna be doing a review of this excellent, super fun, amazing looking Pelican Catch Power 100. The name says it, it's a Pelican Power Boat. But, don't let the name fool you. This thing, you could definitely paddle. We're gonna show you more on that on this review. But one thing, one word that I will use to describe this boat is fun. This is a fun boat, this thing is super fun. The things that you could do with this little tiny boat is just plain amazing. Now, the way I do my reviews, I'm gonna give you the positive and I'm gonna give you the negative. The negatives are coming later on this video. So if you just watch two minutes of it and you go, oh, you suck, all you're saying is good things, how much did they pay you? Well, you're the one who has a problem because you didn't listen to the whole thing. So it's on you, not me. Now, let's get back to this. I wanna start with the good thing first. This thing is an efficient, and compact little boat. It's so tiny, but yet functional that is quite impressive. You can not only just paddle it like a normal kayak, but you could just put an outboard here on the back. Either that be electric or be gas. You could just put it there using this amazing transom mount, which I love. But you could also use a Bispy or a Torquito or your trolling motor. You could definitely just adapt it to work here on the back and this seat is just amazing we're gonna touch more on that later being a 9.9 .9 inches long 9.9 .9, 9 feet and 9 inches long means that this thing is very easy to transport like if you live in a little condominium apartment you have a balcony but you don't have a lot of room dude this thing fits in that balcony most balcony are what 12 feet long and this thing is about 40 inches wide you could just gonna be able to put it through your door, whatever, take it to your balcony and put it there. Think about that, you have a power boat in your balcony. Isn't that impressive? It's just incredible, right? Now, being just 75 pounds, the whole of this boat, take the seat out, it's only 75 pounds. That means you could easily cut up this kayak on your little car or you could just throw it on the back of your 1500 truck. Easy, like I do all the time. That's pretty awesome, guys. I really love the idea of having a tiny little boat you are able to not only paddle if you need to but you could just use a motor on it and you could store it easily now the other positive thing is that this thing is a fishing kayak this boat is a fishing kayak it's loaded with rod holders gear tracks like i have here holding my camera in the front it paddles extremely well like i said before you could use this as your only boat even if you fish on a known power lake or something like that this thing is a kayak right you could take it fishing with your paddle you could take your motor you have gear tracks everywhere you have rod holders you have scupper holes so water will drain out you have handles right here in the front you have storage not only for your battery but if you're not using your battery you could put a little cooler this thing is loaded with fishing fishers so 100 percent it is a kayak. Not only that, it's super stable. You're gonna be able to stand up on this and fish, no problem. You can watch my entire video testing the stability of this boat. Also this, forget it. Also, also this seat sits super high and it's very comfortable. You could fish for hours on this boat and not feel it. So it is a fishing kayak, it has cup holders, it has places to put your tackle boxes and things like that. This kayak is loaded with fishing fishers. Paddles well, extremely stable and comfort. You got all you need to have a great experience on the water. All right, so another amazing thing is that this Pelican Catch Power comes already pre-wired. That is huge, let me tell you, that is huge. Why? Because you already have the connection set up. You don't have to go crazy trying to set it up to make it work with your trolling motor. Here in the front, we got the battery place. Not only it has a little thing to hold your battery in place, but you have the cable. Here's the cable. You just put the battery in the front, you connect the positive and negative, and boom, you're ready to go. It comes with this little adapter. All you do is attach this to your trolling motor cables and plug it in. Boom, you're ready to go. That easy, it comes pre-wired. It has all the connections necessary to make it work and also has a place to hold your battery and it called quite a big battery. To me, that is huge. 900, what, $999 boat with all these things? That's amazing stuff, for real. One of the best selling points of this Pelican Catch Power 100, one of the things that makes it so much fun and makes it so efficient 
as this seat. This is a 360 seat. You could be facing the action all the time. You don't have to worry about anchoring that or anything like that. This thing is super incredible. Let's say you're just, you get to your spot, right? You anchor down and then the current just moved you. So you were anchored looking this way because you wanted to cast that way. And then all of a sudden, current moved and now you're looking this way. So you want to cast over here, right? What do you do? You just move the seed to face the action. You move the seed to face the action. This is incredible. Another amazing thing that you don't think of, having an outboard. You know, you have to like crank it up. You don't want to be like having the seat like that and pulling that thing like that. No, no, you just face the action, do whatever you have to do on your outboard and turn it on. That's, that's super huge, super awesome stuff. Also, this Pelican Catch Power has tracks. The seat is installed on the track, so you could like move it back or move it forward. Easy, no problem. I have it tied down right now. I'm not going to move it, but I'm going to show you some B-roll of that. You can move the seat all the way up or all the way back. If you need to balance the weight of this boat, let's say you have a heavy battery and then, you know, the boat is kind of tilted like this. You could just move all the way back the seat and balance this. And let's say you have a super heavy outboard on the back. You can move the seat up to balance the boat out. So that's pretty awesome stuff. Another positive is it has a built-in transom mount. You don't have to do anything with this mount. All you have to do is just plug in your motor, not plug in, but like just install your motor and go. That, that's, that's a plus for me. A lot of times, even with a Johnny boat, you still have to buy an adapter. With this, it's already built in. This is incredible stuff. Even with the new canoes, that it has a built-in transom mount. Not really, you still have to do some stuff to it because your motor might slip out. With this, this one is ready to go and it has those, those like little top corner thing is right here that prevents your motor from sticking out. And what's more, this thing is super fun and not for a crazy price. You're looking at a, under a thousand dollars, super fun boat. And you get a fishing kayak that is also a power boat that also fits in your balcony or your little truck or little car. This is some impressive and crazy stuff. Now, everything has its negatives. Nothing is perfect. Everything has its plus and negative. And um, one of the things here with the Pelican Catch Power that really annoys me is that you have spaces here where maybe you could put a power pole unit right here or right here, but you don't have any access to do it. There's not a hatch in the rear that you could just go and do all the drilling and the bolting and everything else. You don't have that. You could make one. Maybe you could do one side, you could add a hatch on the other side, you put the power pole, but that doesn't look good. And uh, maybe right here, you could put a little tiny access plate, but again, it's not ideal. So that's a huge negative in my boat. If you compare this boat to, let's say, a Johnny Bass 100 boat, you don't have a center console where you could plug in a trolling motor in the front where you have the combination of having an angle board to get you to your place and then switching to a trolling motor to do your fishing. Like if you just put an outboard here, when you get to your fishing spot, you're probably just gonna be paddling, you know? You're not gonna be having the outboard because of the sound, the vibration, everything else. So that, that's a huge negative. If you have like a trolling motor in the front, you could switch off the outboard, change it to the trolling motor and do your normal fishing. Also, you don't see a place where to put foot rest. I think you could rig something up and we're gonna work on that, but it doesn't have foot rest. So if you wanna use like hands-free fishing of having a motor on the back, like a trolling motor and control it with your feet, uh, yeah, it doesn't have that. That's another negative. Right here, the way that this is designed, there's not an easy way to put a bow trolling motor. Like if you want to put like a trolling motor with an eye pilot or something like that in the front, there's not much area to put one. Of course you can make it work, but again, it doesn't have, it, it doesn't have the spaces. I wish you had like a flat area where you could put a bow mounted trolling motor if you want to do that. So those are some of the negatives. Like if you want to be a boat, maybe offer more boat-like things. Now, things that I'm not worried about, I'm not worried about this plastic, this thermoform plastic. This thing is super strong and the way that they're built, Pelican is able to put phone in places where they need it so the boat feels very rigid and strong. So I'm not worried about that for a second. The build quality is amazing. Another thing I'm not worried about is Pelican customer service and their warranty. They're gonna help you, they're gonna respond to you if you need help, that's no problem. And also to end this, because I'm going crazy because all the GoPros keep shutting off and this one's about to shut off too. And my main camera is over there. I just want to finish this by saying I will 100% buy this little boat because it's a great price. It's a super fun boat. I'm telling you, this thing is fun. And even somebody like, like that have never been on a fishing kayak before,
eh, stop recording again. And even someone like Satesh, who never been on a fishing kayak before, he got on this Pelican Catch Power 100. He used it for a few hours and he liked it a lot because this thing is fun, it's easy to use, it's stable. It is a great fishing machine for less than a thousand dollars and I highly recommend it that you go and buy one if you could find it because it's not available yet and with the craziness that is going on today, this is April, we don't know what's gonna happen but when they are available and you have a thousand dollars, I highly recommend it. Go buy one and go have fun. See you in the next video. Uh, my God, like look, I threw the GoPros everywhere because they keep shutting down all three GoPros. This is a GoPros 8 and 7. And it's, it's just a pain, guys. It's a pain. <laughs>